In this video, I'm going to show you how to do crochet ribbing using the back loop of an HDC stitch. This is the way number seven. Let's start with making a chain. You can do this stitch with any number of stitches. So let's chain 12. Here, here we have 12 stitches. I like to do a tight edge when I'm doing back and forth crocheting. So for half double crochet stitch I chain one. Not two stitches as normally uh, is done, but just one. Okay, so the first row will be regular half double crochet stitches. Here I finished a row of half double crochet stitches. Now we're going to chain one and turn. Okay. In the back of a half double crochet stitch, you will see a diagonal uh, loop in the back. Okay, so every stitch has one. So to do this rib technique, we'll be using We'll be making half double crochet stitches in these uh, in this back loop over here. Okay, and uh, when we do this, this pushes the top two loops forward, making a nice chain over here. Okay, so let's continue and. Uh, you're going into this diagonal loop in the back of each half double crochet stitch. Okay, let's do a couple more. Right here, this is where you're going. Yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through all stitch, all loops. Okay, so I'll meet you at the end of the row. Here I finished a row of half double crochet stitches made in the back diagonal loop of the stitches of the previous row. I made the last half double crochet in the same loop. Okay, so if you turn around, you have a nice, beautiful chain that's turned to the front. Okay, you can make the last stitch into both loops of the last stitch of the previous row. This will give you, I guess, a better symmetry, you know, to the other edge. But you can do either or. That's your choice, okay? Um, let, let's see. If I do this stitch... in the two loops, the top loops over here, Let's see what happens, how it's going to look. Okay. Okay, so let, now let's chain one and turn. Okay, so it looks kind of symmetrical to the other edge. So it's either or. Either way works. I tried it both ways. And uh, it just uh, depends on what you prefer. Okay, so let's continue. We chained one, turned, and we're going to continue doing this stitch the same way into these diagonal loops that are in the back of each half double crochet stitch of the previous row. So we're just going to keep going and every, every row after that will be the same. So what you're going to end up with, the same pattern on both sides. So 
So let me do several rows of this um, technique and I'll show you how it looks like. So here I finished several rows uh, of ribbon using the back loop of a half double crochet stitch every row. It looks very nice. As you can see, it has a full chain um, that you can see the laying the horizontal way. It looks the same on the other side. Um, it's very similar to the knitting crochet ribbon. And uh, it's very easy to do and crochets um, fast and nice. And I like these type of ribs where you can see the full chain, not just one half of it. Okay, so here's how to do a crochet rib way number seven using the back loop of a half double crochet stitch. Happy crocheting everyone!